On this tutorial guys, you will learn on how to paint step-by-step -step classic windmill, colorful trees, and also the off-road. And guys don't forget to subscribe my channel for more free painting tutorial in the near future and also updates on my channel. Guys I have here the uh, 10 inches by 12 inches plain white canvas. First thing to do is I'm, I'm going to uh, create the sky. I'm gonna paint directly the uh, cobalt blue using this 1 inch flat brush. At the very top my canvas I'm going to paint directly the cobalt blue this is for my sky then after that I'm gonna add water to my cobalt blue and just paint here directly paint cobalt blue this is for my sky or the base color of my sky on this area. And after that, I'm going to uh, mix the color of the cobalt blue and the titanium white. Cobalt blue and the titanium white create the sky blue color and just add a very small amount of hawker green just a small amount of hawker green just add more uh, hawker green to create the uh, greenish sky blue color at this very uh, bottom of this area bottom of my sky Then after that, I'm going to mix the color of the Mars black and the cobalt blue. Mars black and the cobalt blue. I'm going to mix this color to create the dark, dark blue. But it should be more uh, cobalt blue to create this kind of color here. Just add here for my clouds or my the dark, darker clouds. I just blend this color also a little bit uh, upper portion of this uh, green sky here at the bottom upper portion and also just blend this color just add more darker sky blue here for my clouds using just observe my brush strokes guys I'm using the uh, circular type of my brush strokes for these clouds here I'm gonna mix again the Mars black and the cobalt blue. It should be more uh, cobalt blue, maybe 70% of cobalt blue and 30% of Mars black color to create this dark blue color. Just add here for my clouds. Just looking good for my sky here, a very nice sky in this area. Then after that, I'm going to mix the color of the, or just add small amount of titanium white to the dark blue color. Just small amount of titanium white to create a little bit lighter color. Just paint here the upper portion of this sky or the clouds.
just add titanium white again to the uh, dark blue color to create this kind of color and just paint here at the top portion of my canvas for my clouds or the highlights of my clouds just add more uh, titanium white to the dark blue color create more lighter color and just add here for more highlight color of the clouds Just looking good for my sky here and also just blend this dark portion in this area to the lower portion of my color then the titanium white at the very bottom here to, and also just blend this color Just looking good, a very nice sky in this area here. And after that, I'm going to mix the color of the Mars black and the cobalt blue. Mars black and the cobalt blue. Just add here for my for my mountain, the base color of my mountain in this area. I'm going to change my brush. I'm gonna mix the color of the titanium white in the cobalt blue to create the lighter color. Just add more titanium white, create the sky blue color, or more lighter sky blue. And just paint here for the highlight of this mountain and also just blend this color. Just looking good in the cobalt blue here, the back portion. The cobalt blue for my mountain, the dark portion of the mountain that are not affected by the lights. the Mars black and the cobalt blue Mars black and the cobalt blue for the darker dark portion of this mountain Uh, the shading effects to this mountain the area that not does not affected by the uh, lights I'm gonna add shading
just like that there just mix again the titanium white in the cobalt blue to create more uh, light color lighter sky blue just add here for the highlight effects to this mountain here also this one here should be more highlight because it's very top, it's very uh, higher Then the cobalt blue, I'm going to add the cobalt blue at the lower portion so add the cobalt blue here at the lower portion of this mountain the area that are uh, not enough uh, light cobalt blue directly paint the cobalt blue and uh, it should be a uh, blend this cobalt blue to the color background so that it will create a very nice color blending to the to the painting just looking good to this area here then just blend the color at the very lower portion here just blend Now we have a very nice mountain in the sky in that there. Then after that I'm going to uh, add also the, I'm going to mix the color of the cobalt blue and the uh, violet color or the deep violet. Just add small amount of Mars block to create this kind of color here. Just add here for my another mountain, the near, a little bit near mountain to this area. Then the Mars black color, I'm gonna paint directly the Mars black color. Just continue blending with this color here. The Rushina and also the uh, Cobalt Blue. Rushina and the uh, Cadmium Yellow. And add small like uh, Cobalt Blue. Just paint here for the color of this mountain. And looking good just blend to create this kind of blurry effects to this mountain here at the very far mountain then after that I'm going to uh, uh, paint directly the Rushina color here paint directly the Rushina to this mountain here for my highlight this mountain The Mars black. I'm going to add the Mars black color also. Just paint directly the Mars black color here with the uh, with the shading effects to this mountain here.
just looking good in that area there. Then the hawker green. I'm gonna add the hawker green at the very lower portion of this mountain where the color of the grasses at the lower portion of this mountain here. Very nice mountain. Then the Rushina color, I'm gonna paint also the Rushina here. Then the Hawker Green, I'm gonna paint the Hawker Green. I'm going there, just blend so that it will create a very uh, smooth color blending or the uh, smooth color or blurry effects to the color. It's very nice that there. Then I'm going to mix the color of the Rushina and the orange yellow. Rushina and the orange yellow. Just add small amount of uh, light green color, just small amount for this kind of color here. Just paint also here. Then the cadmium yellow, going to add the cadmium yellow for more highlight color to this mountain here. My light source is coming from this area, that's why I'm going to add more highlights to this side from my, from my left side of my canvas. Now let's continue here. I'm going to add a small detail to these mountains, the far mountains there. I'm gonna mix the color of the uh, orange yellow and the Rushina. Rushina and the orange yellow, just add small amount of Cobalt blue, then add the Rushina color, just paint here. At the very uh, bottom, this, I uh, know, not the bottom, next to the highlight color, I'm going to paint this kind of color for more, uh, to give more uh, uh, nicer color of the mountain or the mountains here. And after that, I'm going to mix the color of the titanium white and the orange yellow. Mix this to create the uh, lighter orange. Just paint here at the upper portion, a little bit upper, for more highlight effects to this mountain here. Just blend also this color with using the dry brush. Just blend using the dry brush. Create a very nice and smooth effect to the mountain. It's very nice here. It's very just continue. 
a very nice mountain there then after that I'm going to mix the color of the poker green and the cobalt blue poker green and the cobalt blue at the very uh, lower portion of this mountain for the grasses here for the uh, trees to this mountain Just blend also this color so that it will uh, create a very nice color effects here for my mountain going down. Then after that, I'm going to mix the color of titanium white and the cobalt blue. Just small amount of cobalt blue to the titanium white. Just add more titanium white to create the lighter gray or the lighter sky sky blue color. Just paint here. Just looking good to that there, and also I'm going to make my uh, brush here into dry. I have a rug. If you have a rug, you can uh, use your rug to make the uh, the hair of your brush to dry. Just looking good there. So this one using the dry brush. Gonna blend this color here at this mountain to create a this kind of here the fogs effect of this mountain. So just continue here. We have a very nice, good looking mountain there. Just continue blending this color here. Just looking good in that area there. Then I'm going to mix the color of the Marsh black and the cobalt blue, and just add a small amount of hawker green to create this kind of color, the dark green color with the with the cobalt blue. Just paint here at the back portion of this mountain. very nice for my mountain there just continue and just also blend this color get a very nice color effects to this mountain here yeah, that's looking good to that there then after that I'm going to uh, add detail for this mountain I'm going to paint directly the cadmium yellow at the very uh, lower portion of this mountain here for my grasses or the highlight of my grasses to this area Then the hawker green at this area here at the very bottom of the mountain. Then the marsh black and the hawker green. I'm going to mix this color. Just paint here the darker uh, grass or the trees here or the shading and also the trees that are not affected to the uh, light source that's why it's a little bit darker or uh, just continue there looking good Just looking good in that area there. Just blend also this color to the cadmium yellow to create a very nice color effects in that area. 
with the titanium white just blend this titanium white to the cadmium yellow to create a very light yellow here also just blend this color to create the blurry effects going to the very far grasses there just looking good in that area there then after that I'm going to uh, create the trees I'm going to create the trees here using this uh, I'm gonna mix the color of the ochre green and the Mars black this area here for the uh, base color of the trees here Then the light green color also I'm gonna add here for the highlight of this tree or highlight of these trees here. Just looking good in that area there. And after that I'm going to paint also the hawker green for the grasses to the ground. Hawker green here. Then the light green color also for the grasses here and the ground. And the dark green color. Just looking good in that area there. Then after that, I'm going to create a very uh, big tree in this area in this side. So first, I'm going to uh, create the directly paint here, the violet color, the violet color on this side here. For my uh, tree, but it should, you can also it should be blend this color, but it will uh, create a very nice color, a blurry effect to the to this tree, just like that there. Then after that, I'm going to uh, add the trunk and branches using the Mars black color and the pointed brush, the number zero brush. I'm going to paint directly here for the trunk and the branches to this tree using the pointed brush here the branch and the twigs paint directly here in Mars black color for this tree just looking good and after that I'm going to add the highlight of that tree there I'm going to mix the color of the deep violet and the cadmium yellow. Deep violet. Just paint here for the little highlight. Highlight of this tree here. Or just mix the color of the violet color and the titanium white. Create a uh, Lavender color for this here for the highlight of this tree, the upper portion of this tree here. Just sticking good for my tree on that area there. Then the uh, light green color also I'm gonna add to this area, to this tree. For the green color of the leaves at the lower portion. This uh, the light green color. Green down. Just looking good in that area there. Also, I'm going to add more titanium white to the 
uh, deep violet to create more lighter lavender just paint here for the uh, more highlight color effects to this tree here Just looking good here, a very nice tree. Just continue adding with this a light green color to this tree for more uh, green color of the leaves and this under this tree here. Just continue adding with this light green color. I have a very nice looking good tree here. Then after that, I'm going to create the little bit large or the dark paint directly the uh, cadmium yellow for the another color of the tree or the trees. Cadmium yellow there. Then the titanium white for the highlight on this tree. Oops, I'm going to just blend also this color. Tighten white. Just blend this titanium white to the yellow color, the cadmium yellow. Just looking good in that area there. And after that, I'm going to create also the another. I'm gonna mix the color of the orange yellow and the violet color. Just add more violet color to this area here, a little bit nearer. Just blend also this color here. Just continue for my near tree, a little bit nearer. Then after that, I'm going to get again the uh, number zero brush and use again the mars black color for the trunk of this tree. I'm going to create a little bit bigger trunk because it's a near tree here. I like this one here. It's a small, small trunk. This one is a little bit bigger. I'm going to create also twigs. Oops, the twigs here and the branches. Just looking good in that area there. This one also here. The branches and the twigs. Just looking good for my tree in that area there. That's the base color. Now I'm going to paint directly the orange yellow for the highlight effects to these leaves in this tree here. The orange yellow. Just continue adding with the orange yellow here. I'm going to down porch to the down area of this tree. Just looking good. Then for the highlight, I'm gonna mix the color of the cool cadmium yellow and the orange yellow to create the more lighter orange for my highlight effects to this tree here. Oops. I'm gonna add more cadmium yellow to paint here for more highlight effects to this tree I'm 
or just paint directly the cadmium yellow at the upper portion of this tree. Some more highlight effects to the upper portion. Now this one here, I'm going to add uh, the windmill. I'm gonna for first. I'm going to sketch the windmill here. I'm going to uh, create the windmill on this side here. This one here. They, I'm going to create the windmill. This is my windmill area. to uh, make this a uh, little bit be higher because it, I think it's very small just like that there using the marsh block I'm gonna sketch the windmill color this here with the marsh block color I just I'm going to create more uh, I think it's more bigger body for this windmill this is only the uh, base, co base color uh, using the marsh block color And I'm going to create the this one here slightly just like that there it's like crows or X Just looking good in that area there. That's only these kits. But first, I'm going to finish the uh, on this entire here. This one, I, I I'm gonna paint this one there. I'm gonna add the hawker green, hawker green, and the uh, cadmium yellow going to that area for my grasses. In this area here. Just looking good, and also cadmium yellow here. Now add the cadmium yellow. I'm going to finish this one first before I'm going to proceed that windmill there. Just continue here. Then the cut the hawker green for the uh, grasses on the ground. I'm gonna use the hawker green here. Just gonna mix the color of the gonna mix the color of the cadmium yellow and the titanium white. Create more lighter yellow. Just paint here. And the cadmium yellow. I'm gonna add directly the cadmium yellow here for more color effects to the grasses and also the ground. Just observe my brush strokes, guys. After that, I'm going to create a very small uh, 
way uh, yeah off road to this area here create the uh, small off road using the uh, Rushina color then the Mars black color here the Mars black and I paint directly the Mars black color for the uh, and also just blend this Mars black color to the Rushina create a very nice color effects and after that the uh, hooker green here at this area the hooker green for my grasses And now I just I'm going to greet my pointed brush, the number zero brush again using this Mars black color. I'm gonna add the trunk here for this tree, uh, also the branch using the Mars black color. Just looking good. That area there. I'm going to continue this one here. I'm gonna add the orange yellow. Directly paint the orange yellow here for and just blend this orange yellow to the Rushina color that I painted earlier. Just looking good. Then the I'm gonna mix the color of the Mars black and also the orange yellow. The Mars black and the orange yellow create this dark brown color. Just paint here for the uh, soil, soil to this area, uh, to the soil of this off road. Then the uh, violet color and the cobalt blue. The violet and the cobalt blue. Just add here and also just blend this color to the color that I painted earlier. Just looking good. Then after that, I'm going to mix the color of the, the Rushina and the Cadmium Yellow. Just add Titanium White. Just add Titanium White. Just like this one here. Just, just paint here for a little uh, highlight and for my off-road here. Just looking good for my small road here or the off road. Just continue. I'm going to paint also the Rushina, directly paint the Rushina color. Just selecting the area here for this Rushina color. Just looking good. Then titanium white. I'm going to mix the color of titanium white in the 
cobalt blue to create this sky blue color. Just add here. more uh, soil effect or the soil color here just blend this color also to create a very nicer uh, soil color and also to minimize more warm color here I'm gonna use this kind of color but it should be blend this color to the warm color That it will create a very nice color effects to the soil. Then after that, I'm going to mix the color of the titanium white and the orange yellow. Just small amount of orange yellow. Titanium white should be more titanium white. Just paint here for more highlight effects to this wood. Just looking good right there. I'm going to get my pointed brass. I'm gonna mix the color of the cobalt blue and the orange yellow. Cobalt blue and the orange yellow to create this kind of color here. And just add here for the uh, small truck, the truck of the uh, wheel. Just continue adding with this truck here using this pointed brush. Just looking good in that area there. Also, this one. Just continue adding with this truck here. It's very nice there. Then, cobalt blue. I'm going to add the cobalt blue here. I just mix the cobalt blue and the titanium white. Cobalt blue and the titanium to create the sky blue color. Just paint here. Just looking good in that area there. Then after that, I'm going to uh, add detail to this area. I'm going to use my Mars black color for the color of the uh, shading or the base color only for the grasses to this area here. Then the uh, light green color also. I'm gonna add the light green color here for my grasses. And also the th the cadmium yellow. I'm going to add also the cadmium yellow here. Then the hawker green. I'm going to add also the hawker green. The grasses here, then the light green color. I'm going to add the light green color for the grass on the ground. So, this one here, the light green color, just looking good in that area there. 
Then I'm going to mix the color the light during the tight in white. The light during the tight in white. I'm gonna add to this side here for the lighter uh, grasses here. Just looking good in that area there. Then after that, I'm going to finish this area here. So, first thing to do is I'm going to paint or mix the color of the ochre green, the Mars black color. Just paint here for the base color only for my grasses in this area. Just looking good. Then I'm going to mix the color of the or just paint directly the orange yellow this area for the color of this uh, plants here. And also I'm gonna paint also the, the light green color and also just blend this light green color to the uh, orange yellow. It will create a very nice color effect to the uh, plants on that area there. Now let's continue here. I'm going to uh, uh, paint directly the or just mix the color of the Mars black and the poker green. I just paint here directly for the grasses in this area. The hooker or the darker green. Just mix the Mars Black and the Hooker Green to create the dark green, dark uh, green here. Just blend also this color. Just looking good. Just continue here. Then after that, the hooker green, this area, paint the hooker green for the grasses that are not affected to the lights coming from the sun and the light green color also. I'm gonna paint the light green color and just blend this light green color to the hooker green. Just there. Then the yellow green, I'm gonna add the yellow green also. Going to the far far portion of the ground. Then the hooker green also here for the grasses that are not affected the uh, lights coming from the sun. Then after that, I'm going to continue here. I'm going to paint also the hooker green this area. Hooker green here grasses in this area here the paint the hooker green then I'm going to mix the color of hooker green and the light green color hooker green and the light green light green just paint here for the uh, leaves or the plants to this area just there then after that I'm going to paint also directly the light green color here just looking good in that area there so I'm going to the upper portion of this here the light green color Now 
also this one here, the light green color for the uh, leaves of these plants, this area here. That's looking good. Also this one here, the light green color for the highlights of the leaves that are affected by the lights. Next step is I'm going to create the uh, flowers here. So I'm gonna paint directly the the uh, scarlet scarlet red for the flowers. The flowers of this here. Scarlet red, and adding these uh, flowers should be like uh, making dots so that it will uh, create a very nice flowers to the uh, plant or the plants. Just looking good in that area. I'm gonna mix the color of the scarlet red and the titanium white. Scarlet red and the titanium white to create the pink, pink color for the highlights of the flower here. Just looking good in that area there. Also this one here. Just there. Then after that I'm going to uh, add also the cadmium yellow for more uh, flowering, for more flowers here. Just looking good in that area. Then I'm going to add also the orange yellow for more flower effects to this area here. Just looking good in that area. Then the titanium white also, I'm going to add the titanium white for the white flowers. Just looking good. Then the light green color, I'm gonna add the light green color here under this the flowering uh, area for the uh, leaves to these plants or these flowering plants just continue adding this light green color Then after that, I'm going to mix the color cobalt blue and also the violet color and add titanium white to create this kind of color here. Just add more titanium white. Just paint here for more flowers. Just continue here for more flowers effects. Just there, 
So I'm gonna add. I'm going to mix the color of the titanium white and the cobalt blue to create the sky blue color. Let's paint here for more flowers to this area. Just looking good and after that the uh, yellow green color also I'm going to add the yellow green for the color of the uh, leaves here just looking good and the light green color also going down and also the grasses here The Rushina color, the Rushina color here. Or the Mars block, I'm gonna add the Mars block all also for the darker uh, uh, grasses. Just looking good in that area there. Then the light green color. I'm gonna add the light green color for the grasses on the uh, ground. Just looking good in that area there. The rushina color here. I'm gonna add the rushina. Then the hooker green, I'm going to add also the hooker green. Then the light green color, I'm gonna add the light green color. In the titanium white, I'm going to blend this or just mix the color titanium white and the rushina color. Just add here. And the rushina color for the soil to the uh, Just looking good in that area there. Then the Mars black color, the Mars black color here, the Mars black color to the effect to the ground. Then after that, I'm going to uh, mix the color of scarlet red and the violet color and add the Mars block. Just add here for more uh, small uh, detail to this soil here. Then the orange yellow also, I'm gonna add the orange yellow or the cobalt blue. Cobalt blue here, I'm gonna add the cobalt blue. Then I'm going to mix the color of titanium white and the rushina color. Titanium white and the rushina. Just paint here 
for the uh, soil that surround to this. Then the light green color also, I'm going to add the light green color here. The light green color for the, the grasses or the hooker green, the hooker green here. And the hooker green for the grasses to this area. I just mix the color of hooker green in the marsh block. Just add here. Just looking good in that area there. Then the light green color. I'm gonna add the light green color for the grasses here. Just looking good. Just continue there. And also the yellow green. I'm going to add the yellow green color to the grasses here and on the ground. Just add yellow green color for the lighter uh, grasses to the ground. Just looking good in that area there. You have a very nice uh, color of the uh, the grasses. The dark color, the dark uh, marsh black and the hooker green. To create the dark green color for this little bit uh, small shading. Shading to the grasses here. To minimize more lighter effects. And the Rushina color, I'm going to add the Rushina color also. Just looking good. I'm gonna mix the color of Rushina, Rushina and the Titanium White. I'm gonna mix this color. Just add here for the more highlight effects to the uh, soil here. Just add more Titanium White for it more. Uh, a highlight effects the soil or the stones here now let's continue here I'm going to uh, paint directly the hooker green to this area here for the for the plants Just looking good with this area and also this one here for my grasses and also the grasses and the plants in this area. Just paint directly the hawker green. Then after that, I'm going to add the cadmium yellow here for more highlight color of the grasses to this area. I'm going to paint the, the yellow green color for more color of the grasses here or the grasses effect to this area I'm going to uh, cover this first the uh, marsh black color cover everything here with a black color the dark color using the marsh black for my base color of this windmill then after that I'm going to divide this one here or just 
uh, I'm going to mix the color of the orange yellow and the orange yellow and the cobalt blue orange yellow just add titanium white for this kind of color here and just paint here for the roof this is only the base color here And the orange yellow, I'm going to paint here the orange yellow for my uh, roof design. Going to, uh, I have, I did wrong to this area, so I'm going to paint the the color of the cobalt blue. Just like that there. Then after that, I'm going to uh, mix the color of the Rushina and the Mars block. Rushina and the Mars block here. Then the Cobalt Blue. I'm going to paint also the Cobalt Blue. Then the Titanium White. And also the Rushina to create the lighter, to create the lighter yellow or the lighter Rushina. Just like here, just paint here for the highlight. Just blend this color. Just looking good. Then the Mars black. I'm going to add the Mars black color for the design of this roof here. So it's looking good at that area there. Then I'm going to uh, mix the color of the Rushina and the Titanium white. Rushina and the Titanium white. Just paint here for the highlight. Just looking good in that area. Then the Rushina. I'm going to add also the Rushina color to minimize more highlight color. Just blend this Rushina to the uh, that there. Then after that, I'm going to mix the color of the cobalt blue and also the Mars black. Just I'm going to paint here. I'm going to I'm going to divide this one here for the uh, faces of this windmill. This one is the other side, and this one is the front side, and this one is the right side, left side, front side, and the right side. Every side there is a there is a uh, different highlight. But first, I'm going to uh, create the very uh, uh, highlight of this area. I'm gonna paint directly the cadmium yellow for more highlight color of the grasses here, because the, this area is affected by the lights or the lights coming from the sun. The hawker green also for the uh, shading shading of the grasses. It's looking good. I'm gonna pay again. I mix the color of the titanium white and the cadmium yellow to create more lighter yellow. I'm just paint here for more lighter uh, color effects. Then the cadmium yellow, cadmium yellow here for the grasses to this area. Just looking good. Then after that, the yellow green color to this area for the grasses and the plants to this area here using the yellow green color.
just looking good I'm going to give detail to this game I'm gonna mix the color of orange yellow and the Rushina color Rushina and the orange yellow and just add small amount of Mars black just small amount just add titanium white to create this kind of color here just paint here for the uh, color of the uh, sand to this area And after that, the orange yellow, I'm going to paint directly the orange the yellow, but I'm going to select the area where I want to paint, paint this orange yellow for more uh, color effects to the uh, soil and also the uh, sand or the stones there. And after that, the Rushina color also. I'm going to add the Rushina color. Just looking good. Then after that, I'm going to uh, mix the color of the the cadmium yellow and also the titanium white. Cadmium yellow and the titanium white. That just mix these two color and just add here. Oops. I'm going to add a small amount of rushina. Yeah, small amount of rushina. Just like that here. Just paint here for the uh, lighter uh, lighter highlight to the uh, soil. Just looking good in that area there. Then after that, I'm going to paint directly the hooker green. Hooker green here. Paint directly the hooker green for the grasses here and also it cover the uh, gives more design to this area or more grasses just looking good then after that the light green color I'm going to add the light green color also I'm going to change my brush into the pointed brush the number zero brush and just paint here for the grasses this area using the uh, light green color Just looking good in that area there. Then next, I'm going to add the detail of this uh, windmill. First, I'm gonna add this area uh, a highlight. So I'm going to mix the color of the orange yellow, the thai, the orange yellow and the cadmium yellow to create the orange color and just add the uh, cobalt blue. Just add. And the titanium white, just add also the titanium white to create this kind of color here. Just paint here, directly paint to this area. I'm going to add a more highlight color to this side because this area is affected by the sunlight. That's why I'm going to add more highlight color to this area. Just looking good, to that, looking good to that area there. And after that, this one here, I'm going to mix the color of the uh, cobalt blue. 
and the Rushina color cobalt blue and the Rushina to create this kind of color here just add small amount of orange yellow and tighten white a little bit darker than, than to this area so I'm going to add uh, a small amount of titanium white oops I'm going to add more cobalt blue just paint here for this at uh, the front face to this windmill I'm gonna paint this kind of color this is only the base color also Just looking good to that area there and after that I'm going to paint directly the cobalt blue to this area cobalt blue for this another face to this area of the windmill then after that I'm going to add detail detail for this uh, windmill I'm gonna mix the color of the Mars black and the orange yellow the Mars black and the orange yellow. I'm gonna mix these two colors to create this uh, dark brown. Just paint, just paint here for the uh, for the wood or the separation of the woods to determine more uh, detail to this uh, windmill. Determine this uh, to add more detail that also imp give emphasize to this windmill that this windmill is made up of woods. So I am gonna create this one until it's done. Just like that there looking good and after that this one also I'm gonna use the Mars black for this year directly paint the Mars black color for the uh, for this horizontal line Just like that there, then after that the other side here should be more uh Just looking good to that area there. Then I'm going to add a uh, more, uh, more uh, detail. I'm gonna mix the color titanium white in the cadmium yellow. Titanium white in cadmium yellow and add a uh, orange yellow. Just paint here for the. Uh, oops, it's it's like a uh, more lighter. So I'm going to add small amount of Mars black. To minimize more lighter color, then add small amount of titanium white for uh, to create a, a little bit lighter. Just add here for the uh, highlight this area.
just looking good to that area there and also this one the orange yellow and the, I'm gonna mix the color orange yellow and the rushina color just add small amount of orange yellow to the rushina this one also I'm gonna oops I'm going to add small amount of marsh black to minimize more warm color and it will also create the uh, Just continue going down, just looking good at that area there. And after that, the Mars black color. Going to add also the Mars black color here. I'm going to uh, detail, just mix the color of the titanium white and the orange or uh, the cadmium yellow titanium white and cadmium yellow just paint here for more highlight color effects to this wood here just add with the highlight color to this corner because this corner is affected by too much light or this corner is facing to the light source that's why I'm going to add more highlight color effects to this side That's looking good at that area there. Then I'm going to mix the color of the cobalt blue and the orange yellow. Cobalt blue and the orange yellow. Gonna mix these two colors. Just add the cadmium yellow. And also the titanium white. To create this kind of color here. Just this one. Just paint here at the top portion. This roof just there and the titanium white I'm going to paint the titanium white directly and just for more highlight color effects to this area then the cobalt blue I'm going to paint the cobalt blue here And the titanium white and the cobalt blue. We're gonna mix these two colors, titanium white and the cobalt blue, for the uh, highlight effects to this area. Then, to blend this co that color, I'm gonna minimize that color into marsh black and the orange yellow. Gonna mix these two colors. Just paint here to minimize this uh, color, the uh, the bluish color here. Then the marsh black color. I'm going to add the marsh black color here to minima uh, to create the rough design in this area. Just looking good at that area there. Then the orange yellow, orange yellow and the Mars black, and just add titanium white. Just paint here. The Mars black color. That's like that there. Darker brown. I'm going to add this one here to darker brown. To create this darker brown, I mix the color of the Mars black and the orange yellow. 
just looking good to that area there then the darker brown also I'm going to create the design to this area this one is the Just looking good and after that I'm going to I'm going to give detail to this here to the windmill using the marsh black color going to paint this one here marsh black color Just looking good at that area there. Then for the color of that there, I'm going to mix the color of the orange yellow and the rushina color. Orange yellow and the rushina. And just add small amount of cadmium yellow. Just small amount of cadmium yellow to create this kind of color here. Just paint here for the color of this uh X, X like X like I don't know what is the uh, real the name of that there I don't know huh? just continue here for that color there then the the cadmium yellow and also the titanium white just mix these two color and just add small amount of rushina just small amount of rushina to create this kind of color here just paint here for the highlight that are affected to this wood this is made of wood this one also here I create that one there The highlight just looking good at that area then this one I'm going to uh, mix the color of the cobalt blue and also the titanium white titanium white in the cobalt blue to create the uh, uh, sky blue color just add to this here for the highlight effects to this X like wood that form into a X Just blend that there, and now I'm going to add the uh, cloth. I think uh, this is the cloth there. I'm going to mix the color of the titanium white and also the small amount, a very small amount of uh, cobalt blue to the titanium white to create this kind of color, and just add a rushina color, just small amount of rushina, just very small. Just add here for the clothes, for the cloth. This uh, I don't know what what the name of this X like. It's looking good to that area there.
just looking good to that area there then after that the Mars black and the orange yellow going to mix these two color the Mars black and the orange yellow going to add this one here for the support of this cloth Just looking good at that area there as you notice guys uh, this area is a very uh, more lighter lights than or higher light to this than to this area here because this area is affected by the lights so I, uh, I'm going to add more lights to this area I uh, continue adding here continue adding with this dark brown color Just looking good for my area there. I'm going to add the uh, shadow here. I'm gonna mix the color of the uh, hooker green and the Mars black. Hooker green and the Mars black color to create the dark green color. Just add here for the for the shadow, the area that are not affected by the uh, lights or affected by this area is affected by. Uh, uh, shadow of this windmill that's why I'm going to paint this one a dark color not everything here I'm just selecting the area and also just blend this color to create a very nice color effects Just looking good at that area there and after that the hooker green also I'm gonna paint also the hooker green I uh, have a very nice uh, shade shadow Then the light green color. I'm gonna add the light green color. Then the hooker, uh, the uh, cadmium yellow also. Can I add the cadmium yellow here for the grasses that are affected by the uh, sun just looking good then the yellow green also you know add the yellow green Let's add the yellow green here there get a very nice color effects to the grasses
just looking good in the cadmium yellow here. Just looking good at that area there. Now we have a very nice uh, view. Then the yellow, the light green color, and the yellow green. The yellow green also here. I'm gonna paint the yellow green color. Just select the area here. Paint the yellow green color. Just looking good. You know, guys, we're done with this painting demonstration. We have a very nice view here and a colorful painting. I hope this demonstration is helpful for you. And guys, don't forget to subscribe my channel for more free painting tutorial in the near future and also updates on my channel. You can also leave comments and hit like button below this video. And guys, thanks for watching. See you for my next painting demonstration. Peace.